Is it actually working? It is. Okay. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, John for the Gamer Day here. Welcome to you back to another episode of the Saga Lock. Hopefully, all is well. I think all is well on my end, and uh, I'm just turning some things down to turn them up in OBS, so that way they can be fine. Audio balancing. It's beautiful, isn't it? So, <laughs> Hopefully you all are having a wonderful, wonderful day. Also, I believe if I actually... Can't I audio balance it this direction? I can! Look at that. See the beauty. Okay, see, there we go. We, di we did the thing. So, three, two, one. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, John, for the game here. Welcoming you back to another episode of the Saga Lock. I am so happy that we have this picked up and back, basically, in session. It's been way too long, and like I said, it deserved to be back ever so freaking finally. So, we are here. We are taking on the next gym. I trained up most of our team to level 19 as this gym leader is 19.55. So I was not quite sure whether or not it'd be 20 or 19. But we have Taylor, the hasty nature Raichu. Thunderbolt return, Thundershock natural gift. Then we have... Uh, wow, okay, that failed miserably. Then we have Sean, the lovely, lovely Badu. Uh, with the moves Cross Poison Eruption, Sea Flare, and Zed Headbutt. Then, oh my gosh, why can't I not do this today? What the heck? Do I just go up and down? Oh my god, I just go up and down. Duh. Then we have nickname our relaxed Luxio with Magic Guard as an ability Thunder Punch, Howl, Horn Attack, and Thunder Wave. Then we got our modest natured Gary the Shellos Dive as a new move Zap Cannon, Dark Void, and Metronome. We have Tarant, same move that as before. Rough skin is an ability, naive nature. Um, and then we have uh, Sniper, the adamant Kronkadon. Okay, we're back. Let's go ahead and attack what we were going to. Pardon the interruption. Um, it's, for reference, it's 90 degrees here. And so people are just trying to help. Um, and that's all it is. It's just, it's not, it didn't help. It actually hindered, but they don't know that because they don't know the specifics of all of the stuff that I do. So, no worries. It's fine. Um, we're going to go ahead and attack this gym, and I don't know who I want to attack it with. Of course, Sniper is our last mod. Sniper has the same moveset and everything. So, who the hell do I want to attack this gym with? I want to say Taylor. I do. I really, really want to say Taylor, and I'm going to stick with my guns on this one. Taylor's got a good moveset. Um, and we stand Taylor, so let's, let's hope that that is, in fact, how we want to play that. I forgot how this gym works. Um, I believe this is the right way to go first. Nope, it ain't the right way. But you go back, and then it loops you to the... Oh, wait, it loops you. You're going down. Okay, so that was not the right way. This one is. Oopsies. You mean the one I was going to go on first, but thought that I was going to fight that trainer and didn't want to? Yeah, that one. <laughs> uh, that's a big oops. Uh, but I got to fight this trainer. Anyway, this trainer is a force trainer, so it's fine. But yeah, we're back. We're having a good time. And honestly, I am excited to see where this adventure flows, what goes on, how everything works. We're leading up fighting a dog ride. So good thing I kind of did my thing. Why are you level 8? Some things I just don't understand. I am telling you, like, what the heck? Why are you level 8? Also, why is my mic peaking like crazy? I should, like, I'm pretty far away from my mic, and it's it was peaking, so I'm sorry about that. Um, I don't know sometimes how loud I can be, and I don't realize that I actually have to be more like 
negative 20 some odd decibels. Actually, it's a setting on my microphone that I probably should utilize in, in all honesty, but what's the point in utilizing an important thing for my microphone? There is no point, right? 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 Anyways, um, I know, that's literally a thing. Magmortar, I'm not paying attention. Uh, yes, I want to switch Pokemon, um, after I click back into the DSUME, because, um, yeah, uh, duh. And we gotta use Sniper! Uh, honestly, I am very curious about how well, um, this team is gonna be and how well everything's gonna function, especially after this team grows up because honestly this team has a ton of growing up to do there's a ton of things that it just that needs to be worked on and like i said i'm very curious because this team could go from zero to zero to 60 in 2.5 seconds speaking of hi joy hi samson uh how are you today i know you're probably not going to be the most fun to fight Nickname, what do you have as moves? I gotta remember. You've got Thunder Punch, which is actually good for you. Summary, your attack is 42 versus Taylor's, which is 46. So really, it's what is Wall Rain. Wall Rain's pretty even across the board. I have more faith in Nickname. I'm putting more of my faith in Nickname on this one. I don't, like... I feel like Nickname is a great Pokemon. It has great possibilities. Of course, I'm freaking out over level 10 Wall Rain. Naturally. Um, the, the Heart Gold and Soul Silver is so freaking weird. I mean, just Gen 2, this game in general, is just so freaking weird. Because in my head, I'm just not used to it. It's like, it feels like it's wrong. Okay. Feel like that's a forced double battle. Oh yeah, that's the that's the only thing. That's also a force battle. Wait, is it? Is it actually a force battle though? Bug catcher Go Josh has a stupid Kakuna that gets obliterated by one Thunderbolt. Bye. Have a great one, Josh. Also, you're gonna see me save a lot. Oh, it turns it off. So that was uh, not a force fight that I just decided to partake in. Because this fight is where you're supposed to turn it off. Also, double battle, which I knew of and just didn't do anything. A Mew and a Bronzor. How ironic. So, I re and the reason why it's ironic is I remember when Mew was on Joy's FAP team. Not this season, but last season. <coughs> and, Mew did, or, and Mew did a lot with that and Joy did a lot with that. They're both psychics, so I need to get Sean out of here. And replace it with whom, though? I mean, okay. I would say Sniper. Right? I mean, they make a great... Yeah, Sniper. They make a great team. The worst that you can do to Sniper is Rock Slide. Oh, I saw Thunderbolt and thought that was not for me. <laughs> not gonna lie, I thought that was from... Uh, them and I was like, uh, excuse me. Psybeam. Okay, Psybeam is not bad because I just Thunderbolt and then Rain Dance for just not needing to worry. Okay, so now we turn off that switch and then we do this, turn on this switch. Cool. So that other that other trainer was completely optional and I just bought them because I didn't know what I was doing. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds <coughs> about right. Finding extra trainers because you don't know what you're doing. How how bad did you have to be a Pokemon to not know? Apparently not that bad because I didn't know. And it's not that you're bad at something. It's you're inexperienced. Which that I, I find true with this game. I'm pretty inexperienced uh, in this game's front. Also, did I ever buy Super... I, I swear I did. I have a second page for a reason, though. Yeah, there it is. Five super potions. Okay. I'm Bugsy. I never lose when it comes to Bug-type Pokemon. My research is going to make me the authority on Bug-type Pokemon. Let me demonstrate what I've learned from my studies. Can I demonstrate what I've learned from my IT studies? I, I want to do that. Can I do that? Oh. 
Oh, that's right. Bugsy leads with Ace. Oh, I got scared for a minute. I was like, oh my god, what is going on? Bugsy leads with Ace. Okay. Duh. You knew that, John. Okay. Although my brother's a pain in the mother freaking butt to have as the ace. Because I can't touch it. I Well, I could, but it's risky to even stay in with Taylor. Nickname has a problem with this. Sean gets obliterated. Gary can't... Gary can do something. S Gary Sniper Taran. I'm going to go with Taran. I think that's just the easy out. And I'm going to go for it. But we'll see if it's the easy out. Because you could have like a dark move and I don't know. Oh my god. Okay. Sniper hand was that. Sniper has levitate, John. Remember, sniper has levitate. Okay. Now that we get that locked into my head. Knowing that we actually are dead to... Ah! Sorry, y'all. Knowing that we're dead to crit here, I think. Because that did... 20... 22 points of damage. No. We're not dead to crit. So I'm going to get an attack off because we're not dead to crit. Unless that was a min roll. So, unless if we get min max rolled, we're dead to crit. Well, there's your thing. Okay, just don't be a min max roll. That's all I'm asking. No min max. No min max. That's great to know. That's a low, That was a lower roll, which means actually 22 was the max roll. Woohoohoo! Okay. I, okay. I love, okay. Min, getting min max rolled sucks. Getting max min rolled, mwah, that's a blessing. Um, okay, uh oh. We stay in. I don't know the moveset. I never actually checked the moveset on our ho oh. It could be ridiculous. Blaze kick. Oh, that's not bad. That's not bad. That's not bad. As long as we don't get burned, which we did not. Now we took away any multi-skill or sturdy. And now we rock slide kill the ho-oh. Cool. Okay. I mean, ho-oh being there is a little bit of a threat. It's a little sketch. But it is something. Okay, level 20. We're going to learn magic code, which I'm not going to learn. I like my moveset as is. Metagross. Oh, that's, that's a problem-ish. Um, it could be more of a problem, but I'm going to go into, uh, Taylor because that has less special defense than physical defense. Uh, Taylor resists the steel moves, not the psychic moves, but nobody on my team except for Mew does. Level 17. I'm hoping this kills. It Realistically, I feel like it should. It's a Thunderbolt from a Raichu. That's going to hurt. And you use agility, which tells me you don't really have anything to hit me. Yeah, Steel Wing's your best move. Which honestly does a lot for being resistant. But we nailed in our second gym badge, which is perfect. Take this badge. You've received a high badge. Honestly, that was a pretty tough gym fight. AKA, it should have been a tough gym fight. But we actually had the team to kind of counteract it. I wish it was U-turn. Watch, it's going to be something like... Uh, Encore. That's my guess. Is some move like Encore. Smelling salt. Not bad. I'll take that. Also, we are going to make sure we save. We're going to save a bunch in this LP. I'm sorry if that bugs you. It shouldn't bugsy you, but if it does, I won't give you too much crap. Uh, wait. Oh, wait. To get out of this gym, do you actually have to hit them both again? You do. That's funny. Okay, hands off. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So, we're going to heal up. We are going to go ahead and uh, use some of our money to buy some more sleeper potions because I think that's a great idea, especially before getting into... What could be a realistically scary fight with our rival? Because it's in the ring. I don't know what the heck uh, the uh, thing is. The what the heck is that called? The start their starter was. 
Okay, we're gonna sell Miracle Eye. Um, because... There's no reason to have it. We get $1,000 for selling it. Honestly, same with Dream Eater. I don't I, I don't see myself using that in combination. I'm going to keep it just in case, but I just don't see myself act, actively using it. And I'm going to sell this Carbos, because I don't... Again, another thing I don't see myself actively using. But we are going to buy 10 Pokeballs. That way we can just get the Premier Ball. Okay, cool. The thing they stopped in Black 2, White 2, which is really sad, honestly. They should not have stopped that, but they did. But let's go ahead and fight our rival. I think... Oh, wait. Well, I awaited too soon, too fast. Or too soon. Are you serious? You made the second gym leader? Who is it? It's Troll! Oh, my God. I didn't even remember I named it Troll. Ah! Rival Troll. Okay. What do you got? You got a Trico. Trico's actually annoying. Uh, it's it's not really that... Okay, it's not really that annoying, John. You're literally just making it more annoying than it is. I mean, it is, though. I have to use freaking uh, Sean against it, which you copied my ability, so now you have white smoke. Oh, okay. Uh, that's fine. I could have eruption. That might have actually been better since I'm more specially focused. It didn't matter. Okay, cool. See, uh, Sean's getting some much-needed screen time, though. Ambipom. Hmm. With Ambipom, I'm going to go ahead and go into Tawant. Yeah. Ugh, Tawant or Nick? Tawant. Tawant is... Uh, that's just such a needed Pokemon. This ball does a lot and murders that, which is just fine with me. The murder ridges is good. Also, level 21. Okay, you guys are leveling up a little bit faster. Arbok. That's why I named it Troll. That makes sense. Okay, I mean, we just obliterate it, but that makes sense. I hate the weak. Pokemon Trader, blah, 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 blah. I get that you hate the weak, but uh, that's also not a troll line at all. Troll actually has fun, and that's what I love about troll. Troll makes any circumstance just fun. You could be having, like, the worst day ever. You talk to troll about it, and then it becomes something silly, and you make fun of it and just have a good time. Also, our encounter is... Do we have a Pokemon named Seth yet? Because if they don't, Seth's back! Uh, I hope we don't have a Pokemon named Seth yet. Um, question being, how am I going to catch this thing? Because I don't think... I do not think I have anything to, like, status. Thunder Wave does not work. Oh, no, 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 I've got Gary. Okay, I thought we had Gary. I thought Gary had something. Okay. I thought we had Gary. Well, no, shoot, you had Gary. That that was obvious. Okay, Dark Void, put you to sleep. But how am I going to catch you otherwise? Like, I guess I've got Dive. I, can, I don't know if Dive would kill, though. And I don't want to risk that quite right now. Let me use a Fastball. Makes a Pokemon that is easier. A Pokemon that makes it easier to catch fast Pokemon. This is a pretty fast Pokemon. It's 101 speed. Let's get it. I'm gonna open my door because I'm... Yes! Okay, we got it. Cool. That was that was actually way easier than I thought it was gonna be. It's six foot three, two oh nine. Hmm. Okay. What do we I mean I'm naming it Seth. Obviously, we missed the boy. I haven't been able to talk to him for a long time. Probably because I haven't reached out. That's my bad. Um, okay, Seth. Inbox one. I've got a lot of good Pokemon. I gotta check in the box. Which has me thinking, do I want to do that and end the episode? Or do I want to do the dumb Farfetch'd puzzle and end the episode? Because both are viable options. Hmm. I think we got plenty of time to see our Pokemon. Because they're going to be part of the adventure for quite a long time. Also, uh, John, save. <laughs> you just caught an important Pokemon that's going to probably be on your team at some point. Save. Okay, Farfetch Puzzle. Because I have a feeling that it's going to break at the Farfetch Puzzle. Okay, you're seeing my direction. Oh, that's another one of my favorite Pokemon. Wow. Okay, this area might be just a fun thing. Kwa. 
Wait, but there's a second one. There's one more missing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, I, was, I was like, I swear in this one there's two. Polytone. Imagine if we get a if we get a shiny in this area, that'll be really cool. This would be the area I would love to get a shiny in. Big mushroom. I this is gonna be the game that I get it too. The game that crashes and is buggy. Like there's no other game to get it in, realistically speaking. Okay, so what you're gonna see, you're gonna see me, and you're gonna move. I didn't sneak up behind you. Okay. Can I just do that? I can. Ha ha ha! Wow, okay. Why? Why do I make that? I complained about that puzzle. Can we just talk about that for a second? I complain and I just automatically did it probably because I've done it so many times now and failed miserably on many playthroughs but we got it <laughs> okay we gotta teach cut to somebody everybody's able to which is actually a nice surprise I don't want to wreck Sean's moveset if anybody's moveset I can mess with it's probably Gary's Yeah, it's, it's Gary's moveset that's getting messed with. Gary's kind of the... The mon that's going to be messed with in this playthrough, sadly. By Metronome. I don't want to risk explosioning, explosioning, explosion on Metronome. So, that just makes the most sense to me. No no point in being over, overly risky here. Just kind of do my thing. Also, that is an item. I thought it was. Neverbolt Ice. We'll take it. Joy would be proud of it. A polywirl, not a... Oh, it's got a Rita Trap. Okay, so we have to fight all the polywirls. That's a great thing. Hi, uh, bye. I like how I just skipped over her dialogue. I was like, nope, not talking to you. <laughs> Even though she probably said something important for later on. I just was like, nope, I'm skipping your dialogue. Honestly, we might be able to make it to Goldenrod and then have another freaking gym. Because this game does that with a lot of the back-to-back -back gym situations. Okay. Wow, we made it a long way through this grass. Are we actually going to... No, there's no way, right? Grandpa! I don't care. I don't care about the daycare. I really don't. Thank you for leaving me alone, Ethan. I do appreciate that. Oh. I said thank you for leaving me alone, and then they gave me their phone number, so they won't leave me alone. Great. We love it. Okay. I actually did make it all the way to Goldenrod <laughs> without encountering a single trainer. Well, I mean, hey, that's good, though. And that's Screech. So we do have to get an encounter here. And I guess we can get Kenya while we're at it, too. Nice. Okay. Encounter. Oh, okay. You know what? You know what? You know what? No, no, no. I'm not going to complain about this because I actually stand Luminion, okay? For all you Luminion haters, I hate Finion. Finion can die in a hole. Luminion, though? Luminion, though? I don't mind this beautiful fish. Like, this beautiful fish can do many things. It might be annoying. I wouldn't doubt it being annoying. But it's a beautiful fish. Do many things. And we're going to catch it. That's what's going to happen. Nope, apparently not. Ugh. Okay, I'm going to switch into Budu, actually. Because Budu actually does the most here. I know, you're threatened by Budu. It's fine. You don't have to be threatened by the Budu. Also, this is a pretty fast fish, too. So, we're getting some speed demons on the team. I'm going to name you. Name 
Louise. Louise the Luminion. That actually was unintended alliteration, and we'll take that. Okay. Um, I'm not too worried. I got. I should probably save before entering some things. Okay, yes. Save. Because I have to do the um, PC. I don't want the PC to glitch. Where do we go and collect uh, Luminion there? Or not Luminion. Uh, Kenya. Which we're going to go see what Kenya is. And then actually we will have enough time. Okay. What is... Kenya's a... Okay. A Slugma with 4 Warn. With not the greatest moveset. But it's level 20. I mean, I can't complain. It's not a bad Pokemon. Makarga's a Pokemon I enjoy anyways. So, okay. So, let's put Kenya in the box. Which I don't think I can put Kenya in the box until I mail take yet. Okay. I mean, we can check our Pokemon. Look at that. Someone's PC... Deposit Kenya. And I think there's a move Pokemon option. Yeah, there is. Okay, cool. Okay. So in that move Pokemon option, we want to move Taylor to the P already. P already. Okay, so let's check our new Pokemon. We got a Ho-Oh summary. We Ho-Oh has a Magmarizer on it. So if we get a um, Magmar, we can evolve it. It's got Unaware. Not the greatest moveset. That's fine with me. It's got a decent... I like the nature on it. So that's a positive. We have Brian. I remember Brian. Boopy has Arena Trap. Oh, nice. What a... And a Ridiculously bad moveset for what it is. Okay. Sorry, you're not going to be used. Um, Seth has Effect Spore. Triple Kick, Spatial Ren, Volt Tackle, and a Wrap. That's, that's a moveset. Glad we put you to sleep because we did not want you to deal damage to yourself. And then we have a Runaway on Louise. Again, Fast Pokemon makes total sense. Um, with Bubble Beam, Frustration, Water Spout, and Fire Fang. Okay. And then Kenya, like I said, Forewarn. Uh, not, that's not a great nature. Whereas everything else kind of seems to have a decent nature. Oh, that's terrible. Gross. Um, that's fine. That's really good. Like, I mean, our, our, our team's got a lot on it. Of course, I'm going to hatch the egg. Um, and I guess I'll do that off screen. And then, like, at some point, I gotta do that, so remind me. But yeah, we got a lot of Pokemon in the box. As long as we don't get fully wiped out, we're gonna be okay. And we'll see you guys in the next episode when we take on the Goldenrod City Gym. So, another gym coming up, so that's scary. But yeah, we'll see you guys during that, so bye-bye!